that works out. First yellow blaze. Merry Christmas, my sweeties. Let me go on my hike today. If I can't get a 12 mile, about three and a half, four hour hike in. Get it all recorded. pretty soupy. We got one fisherman out today. Nice view of the lake here. Lovely mid 50s day, Christmas Eve. This is what they call the geologic area. It didn't rain much the last couple of days, but it rained pretty steadily. Alright, we're out of the 
the low land here. We're going to go up to the right, follow the yellow trail. off the pace that I would like to set but that first section was kind of challenging on the water Let's see if we can't pick it back up We're about 21 minute mile of now which is basically three miles an hour I'd like to be closer to three and a half or four but pretty slippery and muddy so we might not be able to do that today we'll see It's actually almost too warm. Yeah, all trails is giving me my own trail directions. Yellow Blazes today. Yellow Blazes, the perimeter trail. Really, I only have the guidance pulled up so I don't do the extra five miles that I normally do, which I think is the Horseshoe Falls section. As I want to get out before dark. It's about 5.20 today, and Christmas snacks are at about 5 at the house tonight. I'd like to be back for that if I can. And if I keep up a good pace, that should be doable. camera out over the 
side here and get a better look at the at the lake. Creek well, is nice and flat and reasonably dry here. Camera and pole aren't super heavy, but having that camera up there on a three foot lever does fatigue the arm muscle just a little bit. Pretty overcast again today, but there's enough light. Uh, footage should come out okay. Oh, here's a nice overlook. Make sure I got the pole all the way extended, and I do. See how that turns out. Very cool. All right. This is the uh, first falls. I guess this is Flat Fork Falls. Hydrolier going down to the falls looks like. Let's see what our pace is now. And we've got down to 1840. But we need to do better than that. So pick it up. shoes are not very grippy on the rocks and the wood. So you gotta be careful on the bridges coming up on the first mile here.
keep right onto the trail, then turn left onto the bridge. Turn left onto the bridge. One place where I have actually fallen. So I will take the bridge. Nice and slow. Particularly on the downhill side. Turn left onto the trail. Then keep left onto the footpath. That's the first mile there. 1914. That pace is not going to work. But I'm figuring it out. Continue straight for a quarter mile. Here's one place where we're going to take the blue trail, get a little bit more interesting scenery. The perimeter trail went off to the right there, but this is a pretty short detour just to stay close to the creek here, get a little bit of scenery. Look at the falls here. Hopefully that looks cool on the video. There's a chance here for the downhill. Careful on the rocks. Geological formation here. Very lovely. I just came down off that cliff there. I might have a little bit of time in, in between each of these little scenic areas. Unpack it there. And we'll go up the steps and rejoin the L Trail. Left onto the trail. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we're not doing that.
turn left onto the trail. Okay, we're going back into the yellow perimeter intersection here. Slightly left for one mile to Pioneer Village Road. So you got the blue and the yellow blazes. We're here on the right. So we're on both paths in this section. Yeah, it's really warm and humid, so I'm sweating more than normal. So I'll have to hit my water more than I usually do. side trail, an official trail there. It's also be a good test. I didn't bring any extra batteries for this hike. So I'm not sure if both cameras will actually last the whole four hours on their single battery charge. Didn't think about that much before I left. But I'm pretty sure the Osmo will not. Now that I think about it, I think it's probably only gonna go about an hour and a half. So if the cameras die, I'll certainly be able to pick up my pace. But that'd be a bummer if I get the whole trail. That's why we're doing these test hikes. In fact, not alone out here today. Another uh, Christmas hiker, or at least walker. Got a decent view of the lake here. time here on the flat. Keep right onto the trail. Look there. I'm going to stay on the yellow perimeter trail. Nice little uphill slog here. Buddy,
hide onto the trail. One mile of Pioneer Village. Oops, that was close. You cut my shoe. That's why you don't want to get your phone much. Yep, I can't work starting to wear my arms out. So carrying that for 12 four hours at the Grand Canyon will be a challenge. I need to work up the arm strength for that. Continue straight across the road onto the footpath. Another flat relatively dry section here, so try to catch up a little time. Half hour now. And we're coming up on two miles, so pace is coming down.
second mile was sub 15, so that's good. myself thought I would be a little bit more mindful and present for this I did not have anything in my ears at least to start out with they pop those in later center area. First time I came through here I was really confused about where the trail actually went. See here on the left, there's the old ways there on that pole. There's a sign up here. Saying we go to the right, and they just to go to the left. Keep right onto the road. up here though so I'm gonna pop in and take a quick pee while I'm here. the action cam viewers that didn't get to watch me pee.
Shall I use the next one? Let me look at my backpack that will help hold that in. That's pretty awesome. like the recording has stopped because you're out of space on the SD card. Alright, well. I'll let us pack this up then. Uh, but that will... I guess we'll leave the recording of the audio running. And I think that means the road will record it on its internal storage. Since it can't send it to the camera, but that'll be a good test. Let's set that there. Uh, lots of dicking around. Uh -uh. in the camera. Didn't do it yesterday because that was a short walk. Not to change it today, so that was dumb. But just won't need my other hiking pole. Strap my selfie stick away. See how the DJI is doing. This is a 44 minutes of recording. This is a SD card. Can't see how many minutes it says it has left. Six minutes left. I think that's what it's saying, so I think the SD card on that is going to be full shortly. So that's a bummer. Alright, well, that being the case, I'm going to go ahead and put in my headphones. And we'll get what we get on the camera.
theory softer 